and welcome to Echo Base Network, where we bring you high-quality Star Wars news and reviews, and you, the community, keeps Star Wars alive. Hope that you guys are having a great day and just doing well. Uh, we've got Star Wars news that just came out a few minutes ago. Ashley Eckstein, the original voice actor for uh, fan favorite Ahsoka Tano, just reflected on her final role or, or final casting as Ahsoka Tano in an emotional farewell, so to speak. So we're going to go ahead and switch over here to cinemablend.com and look at this latest interview from Ashley Eckstein. So you see uh, Ahsoka here, Star Wars, The Clone Wars Ahsoka Tano actress reflects on her final day voicing the character. And I know a lot of people were uh, very emotional when Rosario Dawson was cast to be Ahsoka, but I must say that that turned out for the better of Star Wars, no doubt about it. Uh, but we are many of us are huge, huge Ashley Eckstein fans. I know that I am as well. So the article goes on to say, Ahsoka Tano has become a legend in the Star Wars universe as a consummate survivor fighting for the greater good. And Ashley Eckstein has voiced the character in everything, from Star Wars The Clone Wars to Star Wars Rebels to even a surprise cameo in Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. With the end of The Clone Wars in 2020, however, Eckstein closed a chapter of Ahsoka's story that seemed unlikely ever to be finished. Now, the actress has reflected on her final day voicing Ahsoka for The Clone Clone Wars. The Disney Plus revival of The Clone Wars in 2020 brought the show back to finish the story that had been cut short by the show's unceremonious cancellation back in 2013, which filled in some very big blanks regarding Ahsoka Tano and what happened between her leaving the Jedi Order in Clone Wars and turning up again in Star Wars Rebels. Ashley Eckstein weighed in to the comicbookmovie.com on whether she was playing those final episodes as a temporary goodbye or farewell for good saying. When we did get to wrap it up, I was so grateful for it, and I take every moment as saying, well, if this is the last chance I'm ever going to get to fill Ahsoka's shoes, I don't mourn it. I'm grateful for it. I don't look at what I've done, or I don't look at what I don't have, but what I do have. I started recording the voice for Ahsoka in 2006, and never in my wildest imagination did I think I would be here in 2021 still talking about Ahsoka. I'm just so grateful for the time that I've had to be the voice of Ahsoka Tano that uh, that, that is how I chose to look at it. And the article goes on to say when Ashley Eckstein started, and we'll see, we'll hear more from Ashley Eckstein in just a moment. When Ashley Eckstein started voicing Ahsoka in 2006 for the Star Wars, the Clone Wars animated movie, which released in 2008, nobody, including Eckstein herself, could have guessed that Padawan newcomer Ahsoka will become such a fan favorite in a series also featuring iconic Star Wars characters like Anakin Skywalker, Obi-Wan Kenobi, and Yoda. If the series finale of The Clone Wars was indeed Ashley Eckstein's final bow as Ahsoka with Rosario Dawson playing the character in live action, starting with The Mandalorian, the actress clearly feels good about how long she was able to play the character. That's not to say that Eckstein considers The Clone Wars finale to be her final bow as Ahsoka Tano no matter what, however. She elab elaborated on her time as Ahsoka. Of course... Do I dream of getting to step into Ahsoka's shoes again one day? I would love that. I hope I get to do that, but I also don't look at it that way. I look at it as, wow, I've had the chance to voice Ahsoka Tano now for, oh gosh, going on 15 years. I'm just forever grateful because she's changed my life. So that was a very, very good interview, and I appreciate Ashley Eckstein's uh, forthcoming nature, uh, you know, just telling us about how, you know, you could see the emotion. You could hear it in her words talking about, I don't focus on what I don't have. She doesn't have Ahsoka anymore. She focuses on what she does have. And she has a great 15 year history with that character. Is it likely that we'll ever see Ashley Eckstein again? I don't think so. Uh, unfortunately, uh, for, for Ashley Eckstein, I guess, uh, if we're going to get a, um, Ahsoka, in the animated form in the future, and surely we will, she'll probably be voiced by Rosario Dawson because that's the Ahsoka that everybody's really going to be watching in Ahsoka that's going to be coming. Some of you may, be, may disagree there. Uh, maybe Ashley Eckstein would reprise her role. I say either way is a win for the fandom. 
Either either way, uh, praise to Rosario Dawson and her portrayal of that character. But Ashley Eckstein has done a fabulous job for so many years, and we are big fans of her. So it was good for Ashley Eckstein to jump in and give everybody kind of an update uh, to the character. And she's holding out hope that one day she could step into those shoes again. So what do you think about that? And uh, guys, thank you so much for for tuning in and watching this video uh, where Nick and I are going to be trying to deliver Star Wars content seven days a week for you guys. So, and of course we always have our Saturday night uh, live stream Star Wars show. So make sure that you come and watch us there and please hit that subscribe button. We appreciate your support to the channel. Hit that bell for notifications so you won't miss an Echo Base Network upload. And as always, I am the coach, we are, and you are Echo Base Network, and we will see you on the next one.